Hello, hello guys. Welcome to my YouTube channel. I am Zachariah, the ghostwriter. I am back again with another video. I'm driving in the neighborhood, showing you road signs, showing you road markings, showing you intersections, showing you traffic lights, speed humps, And traffic circles, I know some of you guys, you still call them roundabout. You know, these things are very much important. Simply because of, I know some of you guys, you are busy working on your learners. And speaking about learners, you know, I will upload a video today where I'm going to, you know, show you how to study for a learners test. Simply because of people are making a mistake by starting with the road signs and when you are busy with the learner's test and you start with the road sign it's a no-no simply because of you are starting with a difficult task and you are going to find it difficult and you might think you know you don't stand a chance to pass a learner's test simply because of road signs alone you have to write six different tests so that you can get 100% score when we talk about you know road signs and the easy way to start you know studying about the learners is by starting with the simplest task which is control but i will speak about it on the next video and also the apps that you need to use so that you can get more information if you're using android phone you must get image search or image downloader which is going to be easy for you to get all these road signs and you can see their names and you can get the meanings so that when you're writing a test and they ask you about these road signs you understand them you are not cramming them you are not guessing because we do have a problem of people guessing answers you know for the sake of passing a learner's test and when they are driving on our public roads they see these road signs and they get confused Simply because of, I know that the majority of people who have driver's license, if you're asking them about certain road signs, they don't know. But they have driver's license. And you might think maybe they bought the driver's license or they cheated. No. It's simply because of they, they crammed those answers so that they can pass a learner's test. And I want you guys to know these things so that you can avoid being involved in car accidents simply because of you will understand the road signs and if you are using an iphone you are going to struggle with image search you are going to struggle to use it it's there online but you're going to struggle a lot to get those images that you need so you must get the app called documents when we are searching for everything that we need online using iPhone, we are using documents and you're going to get all the images that you need. You're going to get all the information and videos and documents that you need using documents. Simply because of now, there are certain apps which are working perfectly on Android and when you are trying to download them on iPhone, they are not there or else is a paid, you know, a version of it whereby you have to pay monthly and we don't want that we just want apps that we can use for free so when you are using android it's easy to get image search and it's working well the same way to get why music is so easy if you're using android but when you are using iphone it becomes very difficult so make sure that if you're using iphone download the app called documents so when you get documents, you know, you will get all these images about control. You can identify them from number one until 15. You must know them. It is very much important. But I will speak about that. And also, I will also download a video where I will give you some insights when it comes to your test. Because I know some people, they don't have money to go with the driving school. In South Africa, it's perfectly fine. You can get a driver's license without you know going to any driving school you can download the app called 
you know south african k53 the blue app and study about these road signs study about rules of the road and also study about you know the road markings and everything then you go you write your learner's test if you pass your learner's test you still have a right to avoid going to a driving school study how to drive or learn how to drive by yourself then later go and book a truck and go for a driving test with a driving school truck without taking lessons from a driving school it's perfectly normal it's perfectly fine in south africa it's legal and after you pass you know your driving test then you are a qualified you know driver so the biggest problem that you're going to face is when you are going to do your yard test and also your road test simply because of the certain terms that you must know and you must know how certain things are done simply because of if you don't go with the driving school that means certain things you are not going to know them and you have to be online and get all the information that you will need so that you can pass a test without going to a driving school so i will also make a video to explain those things to you and i will also talk about straight reverse some of you guys you hear people talking about straight reverse but you don't know what's happening on straight reverse and you don't even know what to do when you are reversing to a box i know some of you guys you're going to hear people telling you about a box yep i learned the hard way simply because of when i was there to book for a truck i remember the guy asked me do you know what to do with the box and it was my first time hearing about a box i didn't know what was the box and it was just a bit difficult because the guy was even impatient and he told me that when we are telling you to take few lessons you guys you don't want to take few lessons because of you want to save money but look at you now you know how to drive but you don't know how things work there is a certain way of doing things when you get into the truck the examiner expects you to do certain things the examiner is not there to teach you how to do things the examiner wants you to do those things because when you get to that stage you must know your story you must know how to hold your steering wheel you must know about observing you must know about changing gears you must know k53 you know and that was one thing that i didn't put too much time in it and that's the reason why i'm creating this kind of video so that i can share information guys because if we don't share information we are going to struggle that's all we have we have to share information so i will make videos giving you some insights and i'll also make another video where i will tell you about different traffic departments how they are doing things where they start their year test and where they finish simply because of it's very much important as much as you will hear about alley docking as much as you will hear about step hill you will hear about pre-trip inspection which is truck inspection as much as you will hear about left turn you will hear about straight reverse you will hear about a box you know you need to know all these things so if you don't go with driving school and no one speak about these things you know you're going to struggle when you get there you're going to fail not because of you don't know how to drive simply because of you don't understand certain terms so you must get familiar with the new way of you know addressing things or pronouncing things you must know these things but i'm going to speak about all of that on you know the next coming three or four videos and please guys don't forget to subscribe subscribe to the channel like the video so that you know it can help to the algorithm so that youtube can push this video compared to other videos so that we can reach 1000 subscribers we need to reach 1k subscribers guys simply because of there are some great things that i want to do when we reach 1k you know but now i cannot do them simply because of you know how south africa do things sometimes you can have a good channel whereby you are sharing information you are giving people information and there will be those who are
going to be angry about what I'm doing online and you know do some crazy things that I don't want to mention but we have to reach 1k so that the channel can be verified you know by YouTube and if we get to YPP, YouTube Partner Program, you know, I can put more effort, I can put more resources, I can start doing different deals with driving schools so that I will know exactly that we are good and YouTube, you know, verify and understand exactly what we are doing on this platform because I want to share information, you know. And, you know, there are, there are those who are not going to be happy by what we're doing on the channel by sharing information simply because of it's taking food out of their mouth and they will do everything in their power to destroy the channel. But, you know, I appreciate your love and your support. Please make sure that you subscribe so that we can reach 1K and we can move to the next step of this channel. Thank you.